phone is out of storage, it's time to clear out some space. But before you delete anything off of your phone, make sure you've backed it up appropriately if it isn't something you want to lose. I sync mine with Google Photos. So first I'll open my Google Photos app to make sure that everything is fully backed up. If you haven't opened Google Photos in a while, this could take a while. If you see a little arrow watermark in the corner of any photos or videos, or notice there's a syncing icon up in the top right, leave your Google Photos app open for a while and just let it finish uploading everything so that you can safely remove it from your device. Once everything is finished syncing, the arrow will be gone from all the photos and you'll see a green check at the top. Now you're safe to delete the originals from your phone without losing them because they're backed up on Google Drive, assuming you have your settings configured that way. Before I do any mass deleting, I always do one test delete. Delete one picture and delete it from the recently deleted photos and just double check that it is still in my Google Photos so then I know everything's going to be fine when I delete it all off of my phone. So the basic idea is hide any photos you don't want to delete, delete everything that's left visible, and then unhide the photos that you kept. This will keep them organized in their original albums or favorites without any additional work to reorganize them. So first open your favorites album, click select, select all, and then scroll down to choose hide. And repeat that process for any other albums you want to keep protected from deleting. When you click select all, it may take a few seconds to actually respond if your albums are really large. Then you'll need to decide how granular you care to go with this uh, you know, analysis of what you're going to delete. Do you just need to clear out space quickly? Then I'd recommend starting with your videos folder. You can open that album, select, select all, and delete, and you're going to clear up likely gigs of space right there. That may be all you need to do and you can just stop. But if you want to be more thorough and go through all your photos too, go to your recents album. And if you don't care about saving anything that's left visible on your device and you just want to delete all of it, unfortunately there's not a select all button on the recents album. But you can click the bottom right photo and drag up to highlight everything. It'll take a little while to scroll all the way to the top, but you can get there. And that's the best way to go if you just want to wipe out everything, except for the things you've already hidden. Um, if you want to be a little bit more selective, maybe there's some things you want to keep on your phone that you didn't have in your favorites album yet, um, then you can click on library and select to group by date. And then for every day, it gives you a button to select all. And you can just keep clicking select all on several days to uh, delete everything from those days and if you see any individual photo that you want to actually keep just tap that one photo to unselect it and then periodically go ahead and hit delete so you anything you have selected is what you're deleting out continue to do that as long as you want to you can go all the way through your whole history of your phone if you want or just until you've cleared up as much space as you need to then once you've cleared out everything you feel like removing go to your deleted photos album and select all, delete all again. This is the step that will actually remove them from your device and free up some space. So again, before you do this, make sure that your deleted photos are backed up somewhere unless this is something you want to lose. And now that you've freed up your space, go to your hidden album, select all, and then click unhide. And this will take a little while for it to catch up with itself, especially if you're unhiding thousands of files. Um, your albums may still look like they're empty or the counts won't look quite right for a minute or so. Give it just a little bit of time and it'll catch up and uh, then you'll see all of your photos you had saved right where you expect to see them. To see how much space you've freed up, go to Settings, General, and then iPhone Storage and that will show you how much space you now have available. So I hope this helps.